Hi guys, I hope you're having a good weekend. We thought we would bring you a video today which has remained unseen, I yeah. believe. And that's one of Charlotte's ones. We do like to kind of intersperse our uploads of those because first and foremost, charity which we have set up and work with is in Charlotte's name. So I think it's important we retain at least some focus on the legacy she left us in terms of her video content. And I think you, before we move on to that, would like to say a few thank yous for recent fun um, Yeah, indeed I would. I mean, it's strange to think I was saying to Mars that it's actually four years ago this month that she had her diagnosis. So four years ago in two weeks' time was when um, all our lives completely turned around and uh, she got, uh, well, she, her headaches were getting worse and uh, we got the diagnosis on the 18th of July. Um, I'd very much like to thank um, Barnaby and David. They did an amazing run. Well, poor Barnaby couldn't because he did 30 miles. They were doing the 52, 53 miles. mile challenge over the South Downs, which is no easy task. Uh, miles and I know, obviously, because we've walked there and back. And uh, David managed to finish, and they raised 700 pounds, over 700 pounds, which mm -hmm. was absolutely brilliant. I'd also like to thank Team CNCS, which is a team that ran for Charlotte's Bag, and I don't know how much money they've raised, I'll probably find out tomorrow, but they're people that I work with, so thank you very much to uh, Lorna and Catherine and Nicola and anybody else that I've missed out, because there's some of the people I didn't know, but thank you so much for that, that will you know, make a massive difference and every single penny will go straight to research, because as we said, we don't take anything for ourselves, so that's a marvellous piece of news. Um, thank you again for people that are following us on Twitter and Charlotte's Legacy. The more people that could follow it, I would be terribly grateful. Um, on Charlotte's Legacy, I recently put a status up and I thank the 170 shares that we've had. Mm -hmm. And it was basically sharing a piece of information which was um, put through by the government on brain tumours. So if you want to have a look at that, please uh, follow or we'll friend you on Charlotte's Legacy. Mm -hmm. And then another lovely piece of news this week, which I know that Charlotte would have been absolutely thrilled with, is that Mars, first of all, got his, he's just completed his second year at, at Southampton University, and you were dreading the results, mm -hmm. very much dreading the results. He got a first in his first year, and we're pleased to say that he got a first again in his second year. Mm -hmm. So he's got one final year left where you're doing a dissertation on... <clears throat> uh, the ethics of healthcare funding, with a case study specifically on glioblastoma. Yeah, so I think that will be, um, yeah, that'll be something for you to focus on. Mm -hmm. And then the other piece of really nice news, which I think Miles can probably tell you himself because you were completely stunned when you got the news through. Yeah, I submitted a paper on the philosophy of Theodore Adorno of the Frankfurt School of Critical Theory to a journal, and that's going to be published in July, which is obviously the first bit of good news. The second bit of good news is it was the kind of judge's choice for all the papers, so it won the Star Paper Award for this year's edition of the journal. So. So, very think, yeah, so we're um, very, very delighted with that and I think Charlotte would have been very pleased. And I remember on the morning of, uh, on the morning for example of his exams, I'd always say to Charlotte, please just look after Mars today, so I think she has been looking mm -hmm. after you. So we will leave you with a piece of footage, it's not long, it's Charlotte getting ready. I think, or, I think she was going to go to bed actually, but uh, it's makeup and hair and blowing hair and whatever else but um, I found it this morning I thought it was quite a nice one to put on. So thank you so much for all your support. The more support we get the bigger the charity grows and hopefully the sooner we can uh, start looking at a cure for glioblastoma. Thank you so much for watching. Guys, I'm Bye. back from my bath. Uh, I think I am now going to get myself hair dried and probably get into my pyjamas and then we will take it from there so let's see where we go so how are you guys what are you guys up to like i would love to know a bit more about people that are subscribed to me 
um, it would be really nice if people also, maybe if you guys wanted like a QA, and a um, that could be about anything, that could be about me, about my cancer, anything like that, I'm totally fine with talking about my cancer, um, whatever you guys want, let me know. And as regards to the Miss Manga Mascara, you can see there's like a little bit left, so kind of disappointing. Let's just do my hair first though. I look like, um, not Will Ferrell, Ferrell, the other guy out of Step Brothers right now. What's his name? Oh my god, I love that film, but I've totally forgotten. The brother... The brother of Will Ferrell, Ferrell, the brother of Will Ferrell in Step Brothers. Just look at this hair. Also, the sort of like receding hairline. I love it. Let's get on with the drying. So don't you dare look back. Just keep your eyes on me. Who said you're holding back? She said, "Jump and dance with me." I don't know what's going on with my hair. Um, like this bit here, what are you doing? Just like behave yourself. Um, what's going on over here? What? I don't really know, but it looks kind of bad. Shut up and dance with me. Woman is my destiny. She said, ooh, ooh, shut up and dance with me. Okay. On to... On to what? Like, seriously, Sean? Like, what? Removed the excess of makeup onto the moisturiser. If you watch my morning routine, you will have seen all the products that I used that I use on my face. Moisturiser, a little bit of uh, Vaseline. And I think that we are done. Wow, I look really rough actually. <clears throat> I swear I don't look as bad <laughs> in real life. I don't look like me, oh my goodness. But um yeah. So, hi again guys, I think I am going to just settle down now, uh, get a bit of sleep and um, sort of like relax after the <laughs> kind of hectic day, um, the amazing day, I mean it's been so much fun for all Twitter and everything like blowing up on my phone, I've loved it, but I think it's now time to go to sleep. Yeah? Yeah, I'm vlogging, but you can come in, you can come in.